，非常感恩今天来到。On November 10, 2016, in Tianjin Gulu Culture District, a private art gallery has just been officially opened. Delightful and approachable, the gallery greets to all visitors. Li Bojun is a national senior craft artist and painter. The gallery is two years of his hard working. Many of his calligraphy and contemporary splashing landscape paintings workers are in display on the first floor. Triple Parade, the international jewelry show, is introduced on the third floor. Triple Parade, the international jewelry show, has collected more than 300 jewelry pieces from 110 designers over 14 countries. Most of the exhibits don't appear to be the typical way of bling bling jewelries we've seen. They look more like artistic ornament. Traditional precious metals or gemstones are rarely used as raw materials. These jewelries are brimming with limitless possibilities. The mantis is so lifelike. I think the idea is very typical of Oriental aesthetic. But comes to all the materials, it is quite interesting that something so realistic is made of leather, gold, and silver. Very exquisite and rather scary, because it is actually a brooch. You almost feel that there is a such big insect perching on your body. Shadow play pieces, medical equipment, clothes and silk threads, branches of Chinese laquer tree, computer chips, wood, all of above can be inspiration for designers. Though to be called jewelry, these works actually are beyond their original identity. They become wearable art or art ornament that artists can express thoughts and feelings with. In the jewelry show, an increasing number of Chinese elements were recognized and adopted by foreign designers. The brooch, for instance, was made by a Dutch designer who got inspired from traditional Chinese tea set. A Turkish designer made this pair of abstract brooches by ferrying ceramic. On the opening day, well-known designer and artist all over the world came to Li Bojun's gallery, as well as the designer of the exhibits. In the Lao, famous jewelry designer of South Korea, this flying ring was a creation under his powerful and unconstrained mind. And as you bend, the wing flaps, uh, feather wings. I think this is great. It is a high level. I think it showcases. The contemporary jewelry really well. And I'm really honored to be part of this show. Eastern and Western elements blend and collect here. The Chinese designer also caught great public attention. Many jewelry pieces may not be suitable for everyday general purpose, but the thoughts and feelings they convey are strong enough to shake viewers' heart. It's beautifully done, and I like the diversity of uh, the jewelry, both the、um, different materials, and、uh, it's it's really well done. Time goes by, visitors are still lingering. The museum has become a cultural salon where dialogues between designers and art appreciation from the public are happening. It should be appealing to all. People understand the works and resonate with the art. This is the most important. In recent years, Tianjin contemporary art market is continuing to mature. Private art gallery has become a social field for art lovers, not aiming for propaganda, but to provide a platform for people with the same fascination, so beauty can be discovered and showcased. DJTV World.